Hey guys, what's up? It's X Supers here, and today I'll be reacting to episode 4 of Oregairu. Previous episode was basically just a tennis match between the popular kids versus Hachiman, Yui, and Yukino, all so that they can defend Totsuka. But anyway, so far, not much really has happened in terms of Hachiman's growth. I'm starting to get weary of his antics. I mean, not even his sarcasm or condescending tone is amusing anymore. I really want to see some growth in him, and hopefully in this episode, we'll be able to see a little bit of progress on Hachiman's side, because we've seen Yukino now getting a little bit more growth with the help of Yui, right? In terms of developing friends, because now Yui considers her a friend because she's able to rely on her. She's dependable and very kind despite her exterior, despite what she shows to other people. But Hachiman, ha we don't know yet. It's kind of a hit and miss with him. He does have the heart for it. I commend him for that. Or rather, I, I probably shouldn't be commending him, but I give him that. He does have the heart for people who are being discriminated against or bullied, you know, for the underdogs. But he doesn't have the heart or the courage to actually stand for it and do something about it. So I need to see something from him that would make me want to cheer him on and make me want to root for him. Anyway, I sp I've said too much. Let's just get on with it. This is episode 4 of Oregairu. Hey guys, before we continue with the reaction, don't forget to hit like and subscribe and click on the notification bell so that you won't miss any new uploads. And with that, let's go back to the reaction. Let's go. Okay, his sister. Little sister? Yeah, most likely it's a little sister. Okay. <laughs><笑> Okay, I. That's the, I guess, the charm point for Hachiman. <laughs> She's the charm. Okay. Interesting. Oh, all right, I see. Hmm. Okay, that's a re that's All right. Mm -hmm. Oh, is that what you're saying? Hachiman does have a redeeming quality to him, and that's his compassion for others. And the way that he was able to act immediately in that situation, I think, is very commendable. But I don't know why he doesn't do it for other in other situations. Or maybe he just he's just given up on life as a high school student, given up on society in general. Just a very cynical and jaded individual through and through, and doesn't see any hope in other people or doesn't see any beauty in others. So I don't know, maybe that made an impact on him. Maybe that influenced his way of thinking, or maybe he's held these views ever since middle school or maybe even earlier than that. I don't know, but I want to see a little bit more of him. I want to see more, a little bit more of this personality, more, th more than just this sarcastic dude, right? And, and I love this, the introduction of the little sister actually, because she brings a little bit, a different side, I guess, a different side to him or rather it should bring a different side to him but i guess he just treats her the way that he treats other people <laughs> anyway let's continue wait really wait <laughs> really 
Oh, she's younger, so she's not yet in high school, I guess. Where's her bag? ロードとはリスクを払いリターンを得る行為である。よって俺の働かずに家庭に入るという選択肢は妥当であり、かつ全くもって正当なものである。従って今回の職場見学においては専業主婦にとって職場である自宅を希望する。私が何を言いたいか
ヤマトは冷静で人の話をよく聞いてくれるゆっくりマイペースで人を安心させるっていうのかないいやつだよ反応が鈍い上に優秀不断<笑>大岡は人懐っこくていつも誰かの味方をしてくれる気のいい性格だいいやつ人の顔色を伺う風見通りどの人が犯人でもおかしくない葉<笑>山君の話だとあまり参考にならないわねあなたたちは彼らのことどう思うえどどう思うって言われても俺はそいつらのことよく知らんからなじゃあ調べてもらっていいかしらおおうんごめんなさいあまり気持ちのいいものではなかったわね俺がやるよ別にクラスでどう思われようと気にならんし人の荒探しは俺の108の特技の一つだあまり期待せずに待ってるわあ、私もやるユキに任せてなんて置けないしそれにユキノンのお願いなら聞かないわけにはいかないしねそう<笑>頑張るね仲いいんだなあ,あいつらはな引谷君もだよこいつ何言ってんだ引き谷君なんてやつはこの部活に<笑>気になるのはあの3人の関係性わかるおゆいも気になってたんだ実は私もそうそうなんかギクシャクしてるっていうかさ私的に絶対飛べ中継だと思うのえっ、okay. ヤマト君の強気でねもうあっあの3人関係性<笑>あっあっあっあっあっあっあっあっあっあっあっあっあっあっあっあっあっあっあっあっあっあっあっあっあっあっあっあっあっあっあっあっあっなんか言おうか職場見学のグループはもう決めたお前はぼ僕僕はもう決めてるよまあそうだな戸塚はテニス部員だしそこから派生するつながりでクラスに友達がいてもおかしくないかたや俺の場合はあんな会話をさも青春しているかのように話し合えるのが友達かもしれない<笑>俺なら途中で吹き出して絶対無理だが彼らは互いをファーストネームで呼び合うそれが友達としての証だと言わんばかりサイカなあ,あ終わり今の嬉しいあ初めて名前で呼んでくれたねなんだとだと僕もヒッキーって呼んでいいそれはやだあじゃあ8問<笑>も,もう3回呼んで8問8問8問もう聞いてるの<笑> Oh my gosh. <laughs> 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 And how exactly did that happen? <laughs> だが一つ分かったことがあるあのグループは葉山のグループってことだ Well obviously 今さら何言ってんのえっとどういう意味言い方が悪かったつまり葉山のためのものって意味だ別にそんなことないと思うけど葉山お前はお前がいない時の三人を見たことがあるかいやないけどああオッケー三人きりの時は全然仲良くないわかりやすく言えばあいつらにとって葉山は友達でそれ以外のやつは友達の友達なんだよ。That's very insightful of them, actually. すごいわかる。会話回してる中心の人がいなくなると気まずいよね。どうしていいかわかんなくて、携帯いじっちゃう。うん、仮にあなたの言うことが本当だったとして、三、うん、人の犯行動機の補強にしかならないわ。犯人を突き止めない限り、事態は収束しないと思うけど。What if all of them are? Omega no Zomunara, Kaiket Surkoto, a Dekizo, Hani, Sagatsu, Hitio, Monaku, Koreijo, Momeruko, Monaku, Aitraga, Nakayo, Kunareko, Kamoshirena, Ho, Hoga. Shiritaika? I want to know too, but. 
I don't know what he's thinking. Oh, well, there's that. おかげで丸子様った。さっきな。別に俺は何もしてねえよ。実際俺は何一つしちゃいない。葉山をぼっちの道へ引きずり下ろしてやろうと思っただけだ。そもそも彼らが揉めそうになる原因は葉山と一
he at the very least gets to get out of his own shell out of his own comfort zone and mingle with other people mingle with these other guys who seem like very nice people who earnestly want to get to know him maybe so yeah that was a really nice episode and we never really got to the bottom of who exactly was spreading the rumors about the other guys it, there wasn't any confirmation so maybe that person is still out there still going to spread rumors about hayato's friends but hopefully in the next episode everything will be cleared up or if it really was just all three of them trying to tear each other apart just because you know there's there's this group activity that they won't be able to spend with hayato or they won't be able to team up with hayato uh, we'll see anyway thank you guys for watching this video and see you in the next one thank you guys for watching until the end of this video click here to subscribe and check out these two videos for more fun content see you in the next one